Welcome to Cruise Master by Vehicle Components Camper Trailer of the Year. We've brought Australia's best camper trailers to a beautiful section of northern New South Wales rainforest and recruited the country's most experienced judges to run their eyes over them. Let's see how it goes. Built rugged and tough, but also luxuriously appointed, the MDC XT12 Hybrid with three 100 amp hour deep cycle batteries is designed for comfortable, completely self-sufficient off-road living. This large 2.4 metre electric awning comes as standard, as does the full slide out kitchen and inside ensuite with fit fit appliances throughout. It also has a complete checker plate underbody with rock sliders front and back. Inside, we've got an internal sink, loads of storage, queen size bed, you can kick back in the outback. The MDC XT12 was quite a tricked out little camper bear. What did you think of that? We're talking about a compact 12 foot unit, pop top, but with an extendable fold-out end for the bed, um, but still all the facilities, off-road capabilities and specifications for a true off-road camper. As usual, MDC have done it very well with the XT12. I actually set the challenge that um, I was going to set it up on my own, and I managed to do that. So it's a pop-top kind of design. Uh, that's on gas struts, so that was no problem at all. And the end fold bed section took me maybe like a couple of minutes as well. So, and then it's got electronic awning, so pretty much you camp undercover with cooking at your outside stove within like five or ten minutes, I reckon. The checker plate underbody was quite impressive to me, David. Yeah, but having shrouding everything underneath is significantly important if you want to go off-road. You want to be hooking yourself on every branch or stick that's on the ground. Pleasingly well-equipped camper. Do you think it packed bang for buck? Dan? It's comparable to, like I said, the high-end camper trailers, but you're picking up things like air conditioning, electric awnings, you know, large full-size beds, interior dining space. <laughs> you get a lot for your money, it's as simple as that. The downside to all the bling that's on this camper trailer is that it is quite heavy. It's got a total um, ATM of three tonne. So in terms of, you know, going down all of the rough tracks, if it, if you, it was fully, fully loaded, you would be restricted in that regard. But that is kind of the price you pay for having, like, all the additional comforts. I think MDC though have kind of recognised that and they've put rock sliders front and rear on it so you can get this thing down a track and they've, they've recognised that it's a big hefty hybrid and so it's maybe going to rub up against a rock or a log here and there but they've taken care of that. It's got the credentials, it's got the equipment to take you where you want to go.